The Florida Atlantic presidential search is in action as the Board of Trustees makes its final decision on who will be the new president of FAU for the next 10 years. Students gathered in the Live Oak Pavilion as Christopher Early, Dean of the Cranet School of Management at Purdue University and one of the final candidates of the FAU presidency, answered questions about what he would do as president. Well, so in, in terms of um, visibility, I think that I, because of my background and especially the global background, that I'm in a unique position to help bring a global recognition to the programs here. And it doesn't mean that each program then suddenly becomes an international program, but rather that they're internationally recognized and acclaimed. Selena Prince, transfer student from the University of Michigan, gave us her impression of Dr. Early. I thought Dr. Early was very well spoken, and I thought that he conveyed a level of um, personal ability to us that made me feel relatable to him. It didn't make me feel like he was such a superior, but that he was someone who would get down with the students and really listen to what we have to say. Anthony Barber, chairman of the Board of Trustees, expressed his thoughts of the process on choosing a president. I think the process has been fair and open and transparent. And that was what, when we started out, that was what we started out trying to do, was to make sure that everybody would have input and everybody would understand what was happening. And I think that that has been the process. So I'm very pleased with it. The three candidates will have their final interview on January 17th. In the next couple of weeks, the Board of Trustees will then pick a new president for FAU. I'm Camila Barco for OWL TV News.